Hi, this is Jerry for ChallengeLifeBetter.com. Got a question for you. And maybe it's a little personal. Do you hold grudges? Do you carry around a little black book in your mind? Does somebody do something that is permanently an offense and you just can't let it go? Okay, got a question for you. Who does that hurt? Does that hurt the person that you were so offended by? Or does that hurt you? You, you may find out that that person just moved on and they don't care. They're off doing other things and they have other friends and that offense that you feel you, you've taken from them may not amount to hell beans in their minds. But for you, it's a big deal. My suggestion is get over it. There's so many people in the world to enjoy on, a, on an interpersonal relationship, conversations and new people to meet and that kind of thing. And people will say things and sometimes it's inappropriate. Sometimes it would produce something that would be offensive. That's humanity. But carrying around a grudge eats at your own soul. It takes away from the humanity that you have. Now, I will admit that there are people in my life that I would never associate with uh, from my childhood. Uh, older people that uh, I had to deal with it when I was growing up. And I will say that they have now passed. There is one thing about holding a grudge and then there's another thing about walking away from evil. That's not the same thing. And we do have to consider forgiveness as well. But the idea of being so offended that you hold a grudge for a very, very long time is detrimental to you, not to the other person. So I, I would like you to examine the, the softness of your heart, the, the gentle nature of, of, of your spirit that's, that's inside. You see, everybody actually has that inside, even if they're a big rough and tumble person that uh, crusty on the outside. Most people have a soft spot in their heart. And that's what you need to access in order to get past something. Uh, a grudge is fungus on the soul. It's something that eats at us and we do not need that in our human experience. Lift yourself up. Challenge your life. Challenge life better. You can do better, and your your health will be rewarded. You're going to feel better. There's going to be a, a wet blanket lifted off your soul. So do what you can. Live life the best that you can. Challenge yourself to be better. Until next time, this is Jerry. Be well.